Welcome to Glass of Bubbly's Food Pairings, and today we are pairing a Slovenian sparkling wine yeah. with some deviled eggs. Deviled eggs, so that's really odd. When you said to me deviled eggs, I've never heard of that. Have you heard of it before? Yeah, I've heard of it. I'm not sure if I've had it, but it's just simply... <laughs> I haven't had it. Boiling so. an egg, chopping in half, removing the yellow, the yolk, um, combining it with a bit of mustard, mayonnaise and pepper, and then putting it back in. Putting it back in. That's the work that I did in the kitchen, so I know how it's done as well. And we had a flower on top of each, haven't we? Yes, from Nurtured in Norfolk. Nurtured in Norfolk. Edible flowers. You know when you've got those cocktails and those foods and you see flowers and you're not sure if you can eat them or not? This company provides you with flowers that you can eat. And it's very good decorative, especially for cocktails, especially for food. Definitely. The bubbles. And we are in Slovenia and we're in with a gold medal winning wine in the spring fling category at this year's awards, the 2022 Glass Bubbly Awards. Previously, it was a trophy winner the year before in the first eight category, but this year it's got itself a goal. That's the Karlovec, and that is their Brut. And it's slightly lower, traditional method, but it's 11%, so it's lower than normal for traditional method, more in line with tank method and Prosecco. Oliver's waiting to give it a go. Let's do some pouring. I'm looking forward to this one. I do like the wines from them. They usually do very well at our awards. This year, I believe they got themselves two gold medals. Two gold medals. And I do believe they did quite well at the Fifty Shades of Rosé. Yes. We do a Fifty Shades of Rosé competition each year. We have some judges coming in to do that. Picking the best sparkling rosé. Um, and I believe this was, I think this was a winner, the Rosé. Their Rosé yeah, was a winner, rose, I, I believe. Was. So it's certainly a name to look out for in Slovenia, Carl said. Let's do the tasting, Oliver. Mm. Smooth, a bit silky, creamy, ripe fruits, a bit on the tropical side. Tropical, I'm pleased you said that because I thought tropical. Creamy pineapple. Yep. It, it could almost be in that tropical burst category, yeah. couldn't it? It's literally on the edge of spring, floral, or tropical, tropical burst. It's just, yeah, definitely on the fence, it's 50-50, go either way. Well, you know what, I can understand why it had the trophy the year previously for first take, because it's very easy. You, you pick this and you, you, you're out for a, a date with somebody, and you've chosen this wine, and it's just, oh, very engaging, you can chat about it, you know you're going to like the taste, because the aromas are really good, so let's do that. It's really good. It is really good. Plenty of fruit flavours, sweetness, yellow fruits, but also a big dot of petals of flowers, buttercups. Yeah. But we also got that good burst of tropical characters in there yeah. as well. It's very pleasing, very easy to drink. It's going to bring a smile to your face, definitely. So let's just go on the on the on the dark side here, the devil side with these eggs. So. Should yes. we give them a go? These, these could be a bit messy. These could be a bit messy. Let's just see how they pair. Hopefully not too hot with the amount of mustard I put in. I like mustard. So a little bit of Dijon mustard went in. Let's just see. The wine came in quite strong first of all, and then slow, so faded in mid palate, mm -hmm. and the palate's neutral. All I've got is little spikes of black pepper, because I've crushed the black pepper into the mixture. All I've got is the black pepper. I don't know about you, so good burst from the wine initially, and then palate cleanse and spices from black pepper. Yeah, my experience was very similar. Came in, sparkling wine came with some lovely floral, and I'd say some nice tropical notes as well. And then from, from the mid palate onward, it sort of died down, leaving black pepper and the eggy characters to it. Well, there we go. So the, the devil style egg uh, as such, with the Karl of Sec gold medal winner at the uh, 2022 Glass Bug Lords Spring Fling. Go very well together. So hope you enjoyed that. And until next time, enjoy the fizz. <laughs>